Hello everyone, my name is Loco and welcome to a new StarCraft 2 video. This isn't specifically a Heart of the Swarm or the Wings of Liberty video, it's just a Zerg video in general. What is one of the most important things when it comes to playing Zerg? Well, it's injecting with your queens, because the queens will actually give you all the larva that you need um, to make stuff happen in uh, as a Zerg player. So, there are a few different ways of uh, how you can inject with your queen. First of all, you could actually uh, simply not in not hotkey them at all, which is uh, something that a lot of Korean Zerg players do. Uh, however, another way you could go about injecting is actually by simply um, hotkeying all the hatcheries that you have, then double clicking a hatchery, selecting your queen, selecting the hotkey of your queen and then hit X. Another way you could do this is by simply hotkeying every single uh, individual queen and actually going double clicking that queen, hitting the hotkey for your for your inject button and then clicking the hatchery. Uh, this is something that players like Idra actually use quite a lot. However, I've been getting a lot of questions about the way that I've been injecting lately. Um, and it's also the way that most professional Zerg players actually inject nowadays. And it's using the so-called backspace method. But I've actually rebinded my backspace button to the spacebar button. First of all, we will need to set one hotkey that will actually make it a lot easier to control all our queens and make this uh, method of injecting really, really viable. So here we are in the main screen of StarCraft 2. Obviously, you know this when you are actually watching this video. So let's go into the hotkey settings really quickly. And we will go to, let me see, global settings, if I'm not mistaken, and then camera control. Now we need to look at this thing called base camera, there we go. Um, base camera is usually hotkey to backspace, which is the standard way um, of hotkeying. Um, and this is also why it's actually called the backspace injecting method. So before I actually explain exactly what base camera means, um, just rebind it to um, the spacebar, which is what I am using. And um, just put that as a secondary hotkey or as a primary hotkey because backspace is really tough to hit and spacebar is really, really easy to hit. So let's get into the actual game where I will explain what base camera will do and how you can use this method of injecting. So here we are in the actual game. As you can see, I built a bunch of hatcheries. I got a bunch of queens right here. And I'm actually going to hotkey all those hatcheries to number four, which is the preferred hotkey for me. Now the first uh, most important thing that you will need to do to do this backspace method of injecting, you will need to have all your queens on one hotkey as well. So I'm actually going to put mine on five right here. So how are you going to do this? Well, let's, for example, say we are fighting right here. How are you going to go about um, injecting with your queens? Well, first of all, we need to select all the queens that we have. So I'm going to click the hotkey 5. Right now, I'm going to hit the spawn larva button, which is X, as you can see here in the bottom right corner. X. Now I'm going to hit the spacebar button, which actually will center one of the hatcheries, as you can see. As long as I just keep clicking um, spacebar right here, it will just cycle through all the hatcheries that I have. So I'm going to hold down shift right now, click once, um, hit spacebar, click once, um, hit spacebar once again and click once. So let's do it. So I'm gonna click, hit spacebar, click, hit spacebar, click. So once again to do this, you select all your queens, hit the spawn larva button, you will hit spacebar once to center on one hatchery. Hold down the shift button. That will actually make sure that you keep queuing that command of the spawn larva. And that way you will inject. So here we go. There we go. Bam! Everything is injected. So it makes more sense when you actually try it out. Um, however, I hope this makes some stuff clear. I want to thank you guys all for watching. This is by far the fastest way to inject with your queens, especially when fighting in a battle. You can actually do this. It will take you about one second to inject like five hatcheries. So I want to thank you guys all for watching. Have an awesome day. Don't forget to smile and I'll see you again. Bye.